everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel uh, if you're here if you're new here my name's lauren and i do travel lifestyle and makeup vlogs so if you haven't already please like comment and subscribe if i can actually speak this morning that would be great <laughs> i just can't speak um so today is day three in zanti and again we're having a little bit of a chill one today so we're going to go and sit by the pool for a little bit we're going to go and try out this bakery this is a really 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 cute bakery it is literally just over there obviously you can't see because it's like so bright so yeah uh, but we're just gonna go and have some breakfast at this bakery i say breakfast it is actually like 11 o'clock we just woke up late because we were so tired and um, so we had a, after feeling not too well yesterday so we had a really really good sleep and now we're feeling refreshed and ready to go again so um we're gonna go and have a little bit of breakfast at the bakery probably have a coffee and then we're going to go and sit on the sunbeds for a little bit. And then we're going to have another run to down to the beach. And tonight we're going to the strip. <laughs> we're going to the Zanti strip tonight. Um, because we said, well, what's the point of coming to Zanti and not doing the Zanti strip? So we're going to the strip tonight. Um, last night was really, really fun. Uh, we went, just went and had a few drinks then come back, just chill. We didn't do much. We just had a really, really chill night. Um, but today, tonight will not be so chill. <laughs> tonight... <laughs> It's gonna be a joke and I can't wait so um yeah I think we're just gonna have a really wholesome day again I think the time so far in Greece has been so much fun we've had we've really been enjoying it so far we've met some lovely amazing people um and it has just been so much fun so far and it, even though we haven't done an awful lot um it's still fun like we're still having such an amazing time um, we are actually going on the boat trip tomorrow so we're going to the um, shipwreck beach and another beach um, maybe we're going to see some turtles not sure um, I love turtles they're my favourite animal so I would love to see some more turtles uh, we are also trying to get ourselves booked in for a tattoo so we'll see how that goes but uh we got from the bakery i got an iced coffee and we decided to get some ice cream for breakfast and <laughs> gabby's got a coffee and also some ice cream and sorbet over there i just got chocolate and vanilla which looks really nice and then a iced coffee with sugar apparently so they put like sugar in it which is quite cool so yeah this is our little breakfast sitting by our pool enjoying it and then we're going to go over to the main pool and probably sit in the sun for a bit because the sun doesn't hit here yet and he hits like the very end of the pool so it's a little bit frustrating but it's fine good morning everyone and welcome to day four last day in zanti last full day in zanti not last day um so hi if you're new here i'm lauren i do travel lifestyle and makeup vlogs so if you could please like comment and subscribe that would mean the world so today is the boat trip day so we're fighting woo <laughs> so we're finally getting on the boat trip today which we're really really excited about um so we've gotten up we've gotten dressed we're in like a little i'm in like a little dress gabby's wearing like a little floral two-piece uh, obviously we have our bikinis on underneath the transfer is going to be here at 10 20 to pick us up so it's currently half nine so we're going to go and just have a quick bite to eat and then we're going to get on the transfer now at the beginning of this vlog you will have seen the beginning of day three um because muggins here forgot no i i deleted the footage <laughs> um i was transferring some of the other stuff over to my ipad and in that time i deleted it and because i don't have my laptop i couldn't reformat my sd card and recover the data so it's fine <laughs> um so you'll see the beginning of day three but obviously not the end of it um i didn't really vlog much yesterday anyway so you know but obviously enjoy day three at yeah, the beginning of this vlog and now we're gonna go and get some food 
and then we are going to go on our boat trip so on the boat trip by the way we're going to the shipwreck beach and the ziggy beach it's like a sulfur beach um so that that's a little trip that we're doing today and hopefully we'll see some turtles these are the breakfast scenes this morning filling up before the boat trip so I literally just have eggs toast and beans mm. it's really sunny today already super hot This why that is coming all the time from the sea? Yeah. All around. This is the sulfur. Mm. You want a picture? If you want a picture, I can make you a picture. If you want to see a picture, I can make a picture. Yeah. This walk down to this sulfur beach is treacherous. Like, I actually feel like I'm about. Yeah, actually, you're not really joking. <laughs> I feel now like... you've said it. <laughs> I feel like. I mean, you've got to do a bit of a side step. A bit of a side eye. Side eye. From this is side eye. The... <laughs> this is the hardest part of the day. This. <laughs> this is the most exercise we've done in weeks. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most exercise we've done oh in beach. So, oh, we got the Google today. just a little side note, guys. This is a sulfur beach, and obviously, you can't smell for YouTube, but it absolutely stinks. Like, you're gonna go, it absolutely smells beautiful. No, it does not. But no, it, it smells like it smells like egg. It does. It smells like rotten egg. Um, but basically, so the sulfur well is apparently meant to be really, really good for your skin. Um, he was telling us on the drive over here that this is like really really good for your skin and that he's actually 100 but he looks 29 so <laughs> oh. but the walk down is really bad but yeah this is meant to be a really nice little beach this the water is really As you can see guys, this is a very popular <laughs> attraction, <laughs> um, the Sulphur Beach, it's obviously very popular. It's good for your hair apparently. Apparently it's good for your hair, it's good for your skin, it's good for your nails, it's good for anti-aging. So me and Gabby have come out with a fresh set of hair, a fresh set of nails and quite frankly I look about 20 years younger so and thanks to the Sulphur Beach, thanks for this. Yeah, thanks for the sulfur beach for the uh, anti-aging. Who needs retinol when you've got the sea? Gabby's just drying off her shoes. <laughs> it is cold, but it's so busy. There's so many people here. You, you're just completely self-defeating. I am. I can't. I'm not. I'm not. Are you, like, are you just the bottom of your feet are just made of steel? Are they? Well, I've done this a lot. <laughs> oh yeah. Sorry, I forgot you're a bloody local. Let's see how long she lasts, guys. Let's see how long. She's still going. She's walking on this horrible rocky ground in bare feet. She's still going. <laughs> yeah, we're going on a beer hunt. It's washing her feet with water. Here she is. Here she is. Here she is. Cleaning the old feet. <laughs> so. We found a little spot. We've got, I've got myself a little Fanta because I was really thirsty. And I just want to show you guys the view that I can see right now because it is absolutely insane. Um, so we're at the little coffee shop bit, whatever. Around the back of it, um, there's a really nice view. So I'm going to show it to you. Hi. How beautiful is that view? It's absolutely insane. So the beach is actually down there. We see the people swimming. There's loads of coves and caves and all types. Absolutely beautiful here. It does smell though. Like, it's yeah, it smells like eggs, like really strong, mouldy, disgusting eggs. <laughs> the views. Oh, being in Greece just makes me so happy. It makes Gabby happy too. It does. 
So we also went with the Happy Days Travel Company, and um, they're the ones that did the tour so for the tour, not for a holiday, um, for the tour. And so far they've been amazing. And um, the fellow who's driving and taking us, he's really friendly, really nice, making a lot of jokes, really lovely. He's called Dennis. He's called Dennis. He's, called Dennis. Um, he's so cute. I would, yeah, totally recommend them so far. Um, obviously once we've finished it, I will let you know the situation. Um, and whether or not a hundred percent to go, but for now, so far so good. We've done a quick picture stop at this viewing point. I mean, there's a little beach down there, and this viewing point is it's beautiful, it's really pretty. It's just pulled up on the side of the road and just taking pictures. It's, it's really, really great. Great. <laughs> African Greece. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's Catalonia. It's Catalonia, guys, right? Now, the 2nd of June to Catalonia. Till when you go. Where the car must go? Front or back? Front. Go back. Okay. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why is it going backwards? <laughs> the car is actually going okay. backwards. He's not touching yeah. it either. Nothing. And the car is that moving is backwards. <laughs> That's so weird. It makes like that tomorrow. I don't know. <laughs> or yes, or some. They say that they are saying that it's it's a magnetic area. Ah, oh, <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. Or it's an illusion and it's, it's like this and yeah. not like this. Yeah. Ah. So we made another photo stop. So this is a port down here. Like those little boats and stuff. I think he said Marias or something that it's called. Really pretty. Hey, can you hear the goats? What, what goats? Happened? But yeah, my ears kept popping the entire time, so it's really irritating. <laughs> um, but the viewpoints and everything, like driving around all the mountains and everything, is incredibly beautiful. Um, and it's nice that they do like they stop off a little picture point. So this is the next picture point near the, the dock. So yeah, that's the dock. So we're at the little port now for our little boat trip. It is so pretty here. Look a little. You know when it's too sunny for sunglasses? It's been successful in now changing the camera. So we are waiting to get on our little boat tour. Oh, having a nice cotton candy ice to wash down the nice sea breeze. Oh yeah. <laughs> People must do. People must think we are related somehow. But little do they know we are not. <laughs> Here we go guys, we're walking towards the boat. Is it the blue one? Is it the blue one? It's the blue one! Alright, I'm going to look at him pulling it in with his muscles. Look at this. So this is the boat. This is the boat. Here's the actual driver of the boat. Yes. I'd love to drive this. <laughs> you capsize us, love, we'd die. I'd give it a go. <laughs> I've given a boat before. Rumour has it, Gabby is actually a professional boat driver. <laughs> alongside a hobby. Alongside a local and a goat whisperer. <laughs> and a multilingual person. Yes. <laughs> Who can sense where you're from just by listening to you. <laughs> so I, she actually told me I was from Greece once. <laughs> we can't do the Greek accent. Hi. 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 I'm Dennis. Yeah. 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 Dennis yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice. nice to meet you everyone. So, I think now we are waiting another uh, minivan, that's why we haven't left yet. Yeah. But yes, in 5-10 minutes, we are leaving, we are going first, Chipre Beach, okay. for pictures. Boat 
it has a brass bottom. Okay. That's so cool. That would be wicked. So long as the wood does in the I hope we get back in there. The, the beach. Can't actually go on it though, can you? <laughs> no, my last one's gutted. Waste of 40 quid. Right, that right, now, Harbour 1937. Which is 40 per hour and 40 per day. Oh, yeah? Yeah. The last name was Greek. Well, there's been a Greek name, Panayotis. The captain was come from Kepalonia, the name of Adam with the same name, Panayotis. They have arrangement with the Italian mafia for getting a smuggler package of cigarettes. And it's changing with the smaller boat, which is in the express, we call it Contrabato. And try to go to Italy hiking and selling the cargo. Unfortunately, we didn't. I couldn't bring my camera with me, obviously, because it's not waterproof. It'd be seven hundred pound, so I don't really fancy breaking it. But we just got in the sea, had a nice swim, went over to this beach over here where they're having a wedding as well. Currently, it's so pretty. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and I'm gonna show you. So that's why they're having the wedding. Over here, always, always in the. Caves will have a very strong concentration of echo. No. Very strong echo. Echo, echo, echo. So, now it's for the mothers. guys that that was amazing was amazing that experience was so good we went in the caves and in the sea now we just are sitting here by this little like cave lagoon i don't even know rocky little pebble beach and we're probably gonna get in the water there's like loads of boats there and it's really 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 beautiful here guys like this tour that they did was amazing and we shout out yeah definitely i'll then um, we go back to the room, I'll give you a little bit for more information about the tour, how much it cost, where we went, what we did, um, and I'll also leave all of the links for the travel company uh, in the description below as well, um, so that you guys, um, if anyone ever comes down to any point, if you come here and you want to do a tour, this one is highly recommended, so I will uh, leave everything in the comments or in the description box for you in terms of that. So we've now finally managed to get a bit of food in us, a bit of club sandwich, a cropper burger and a beer, which is what we needed, wasn't it? <laughs> we really needed some food and now we have food, so we're going to eat that because we're happy ladies. This is our last, thank you, this is our last lunch in Greece. Last lunch in Greece? No. Hi guys, um, we are now back home, um, or back home, back to the hotel obviously um and we're dressed we're ready to go out for our final meal 
and our final evening. And can I just say, by the way, I don't know what is going on with these mosquitoes, but I have been bitten here, here, and here, and developed a spot here. Good. I've been bitten on my arm. <laughs> I have been bitten on my tummy. So not really sure what's going on with that, and uh, that's a bit inconvenient for me. So um i just wanted to quickly talk about the boat trip that we did um and give you guys a little bit more information on it so we did a boat trip with happy days travel and um, so it's a family run company and we actually got the brochure for them through the hotel so we did have another one booked however the one that we'd booked obviously we couldn't go on because we were really ill um so we had to cancel that one um but this one was actually i think probably better than the other one uh we saw loads of things the only thing we didn't see was any turtles but i'm sure as you saw from this vlog like it was a really really nice experience and i'm gonna leave their um, details and stuff so if anyone ever comes to zanti or um comes to this part of the island and wants uh to do like some trips they do loads of different excursions so they do like the turtle one they do a full island tour they do the um which other ones so they do the shipwreck beach and a couple of other beaches ziggy beaches and sulfur beaches and they teach you some caves uh they do a caves tour as well um which the whole experience was just really really nice and gabby and i both thoroughly enjoyed it um so i will leave their details so we our little tour guide was called dennis and he was so funny so sweet had so much information um like answered questions to always took pictures for you um so he stopped off at loads of photo points as well and took a load of pictures which was really nice me and gabby got some really nice pictures if you do want to have a little look at the pictures that we took please head over to my instagram i'll put my instagram here and then you will see all the pictures that i took from this holiday so we're going out for our final meal tonight we actually did come back and have a little bit of lunch so we had a club sandwich and some chips to share which was unreal um the food at the hotel that we're staying at is absolutely amazing so i think it's like um a restaurant that's kind of in the hotel but separate to the hotel if that makes sense um but the food there is oh it's unbelievable it's so good so um i would highly recommend it if anybody wanted to eat there um and then in terms of, or in terms of the travel in terms of the actual trip as well it actually only i'm literally sweating already oh what my god it's so hot um in terms of the actual uh, cost of the trip it actually only cost us 40 40 euro and that was literally a full day like everything was included and we had a really really nice time and we were going to pay 65 euro for the other trip which was going to do less so i really do feel like it was worth it um again i will obviously leave all their information down here this is not sponsored by the way uh we did all get the trip for free um but the yeah dennis was really really nice um, and he was talking to me about my YouTube and telling me some good shots to get for my vlogs and stuff like that, which, which was so nice and so helpful. So yeah, would highly recommend. Uh, and yeah, now we're going to dinner. So we're actually going to a little restaurant called Ilya. Um, and it is literally, I can actually show you where it is. So um, it is literally right there, this little yellowy roof, it's this one. So we're gonna go for some dinner now. Um, I've got this thing in my hair because I wanted to do like some heatless curls after I got out of the shower earlier. So I'm hoping that it will be heatless curls. I'm not sure. Um, probably not, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, Gabby's trying to be positive. I'm not feeling so positive. Right now. And this is on my little dress for the evening. It's a really nice long pink dress. I got this dress from Primark. Um, however, I bought these shoes from Primark to wear with this dress. So they were like these really cute little pink heels. They were si I just smacked myself in the face with the shoe. Excellent. Love, love it. it, love it. Um, the shoes were actually 16 pounds. I only paid seven for them. They don't even fit. They're meant to be a size five. They're definitely not a size five. So Primark, if you see they this. They don't even fit her. Half. She's three and a half. Primark, if you see this. Shave. We do, man. Shave up. Anyway, so yeah, and then we're gonna go out for our final drinks at our favorite bar here on this part of Alicanas, which is called Catacomb, Catacombs Bar, Catacombs Bar or something? Catacomb or something. Um, it's really nice. All the staff there are super, super lovely. There, we were actually behind the bar making cocktails last night, uh, which was so much fun. We went to a couple of other bars first. Uh, we went to Cuba Bar and Iguana Bar, but then we decided just to go for one more drink um, at this other bar, and they let us behind the bar making our own cocktails, which was super fun. Um, I didn't get any videos of that, um, 
as I said, well, I did get videos of that, but I delete the footage, so good on me. Um, <laughs> I only have footage on my phone. I did add a little bit of the cocktail making to the um, Zanti highlight on my Instagram, so go over and look at that if you wanted to have a little look at that. But all the bartenders, the waiters, and everyone there is super, super, super nice. They're just the most loveliest people ever, so... Um, yeah, and we obviously have met a couple of girls from our hotel as well, which we've gone and had a couple of drinks with as well, so which is really nice. So yeah, we're going to go and have dinner now, our last meal, final meal, and I'm hoping that these curls, curls will turn out somewhat okay, so we'll, um, we'll see, I'll show you in a second. So this is the results of my little hair curler, as you can see, it absolutely did not work, and um, the only thing it did do was make my bangs the bit of volume which i'm good with that but the rest of my hair is literally non-existent but th listen who cares last night let's go but let's go and have our last night dinner here we go gabby yay sorry i've just read the cutest post oh love that let's go